All right, Brandon, uh, you're the top O-line for the team this season. How does it feel to be uh, honored with that award? I mean, it's definitely uh, an honor to get nominated for that, but I wouldn't have the success I've had on the field without the rest of the guys in that room. So I give them a lot of uh, I get a lot of thanks to them as well. What can you say about your ability to stay consistent and, and, and stay healthy this season and, and be that impact all season long? Yeah, I mean, like I said, we, we have a crew of guys where – we're here late. I mean, we're we're watching film together. We're we're communicating on what our points are going to be for every game. Uh, we stay after. We roll out. We stretch. We're making sure we're getting lifts. We do a lot of that stuff together, and uh, it's it's been a blast. I love the room that we got, and uh, that's definitely contributed to that. You and the rest of that O line, you're always with each other on the field and practicing, but you have a close relationship off the field. How much does that help towards how close you guys are on the field when you're playing in the game? I, I think it's huge, right? I, I know these guys. I know what their motivations are. I know their strengths, their weaknesses. They know mine as well. Um, we always play for each other. We're always looking out for each other, and we want each other to be the best that we can possibly be. There's been a lot of moving parts on that O-line. A lot of guys have come in. A lot of guys have been injured. But, but what can you say about your ability to stay consistent even with these moving pieces coming in and out of the, the, the line? Yeah, I mean, like you kind of touched on and, and I did briefly, is that we're, we're together often. We're always talking. We, we know what's going to happen. If, if a guy goes down, it's next man up, right? And he's been in the room watching film, communicating, talking with us, going through everything. So the expectation is when he goes out there, he's going to perform at the highest level as well. Whenever you have a game like this, and it's not a meaningless game, everyone wants to win this game, but, but how do you approach a game like this, especially before the playoffs, playing the same team? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, we're, we're going out there to win, right? So that's what the focus is. We're going to prepare for that. Um, just it's, it's an important game because it's the next game for us.